This is the video for operating system project. Here we are going to root the Samsung Galaxy Grand Duo smartphone. And these are the these are the tools uh, to require to uh, root this phone. So we have uh, first we have Samsung keys set up and Odin and Super SU and SWM CWM. Samsung first, keys is used to uh, is used for backup of all the files present in as uh, present in the SD card, and this is used for USB debugging. So first we are going to ins uh, we, we are going to be copying this super SU file into the mobile. Now we are going to connect this phone into to the laptop through USB. So we have to uh, actually uh, copy this file into the SD card. Now the next step is to extract the Odin 3 file, zip file. Now you can see the Odin 3 file is extracted. So next we have to also extract this CWM file as well. So now I have uh, switched off the phone and now we have to uh, enter the boot menu. That to enter the boot so we have to press uh, volume down button, home button and the power button simultaneously. Now you can see the system uh, is showing so to continue we have to press the volume, volume up button. button. Now we have to open this Odin software. So this blue color tab means it has read your phone. I mean, you know, it has detected your phone. So now we have to press the PDA button. So after pressing the PDA file, we have to search for the CWM file, which we have in the root uh, folder. And the CWM file is selected and we put it in there. So we have to check that we have uh, uh, auto, brew, auto reboot and the reset time. So uh, now we have to press the start button. And as you can see, the download procedure is shown inside the CPU as well as the mobile. This will take some time. So now you can see the uh, it is fully successfully completed. So now we have to press here in the mobile, we have to press the volume up button, home button and the power button simultaneously. So this clockwork mode recovery, <laughs> clockwork mode recovery, uh, you can see in the smartphone. So to select particular, uh, we have to uh, use volume up and down button, and to select it, we have to use the power button. So now we are selecting install zip from SD card.
so now we are going to be in, uh, taking the super su file from the uh, sd card which we earlier copied into the sd card So uh, it's actually installing the super SU file inside the mobile. Now we have to go back to the clockwork mode recovery and reboot the phone. So uh, as you can see the uh, routing is completed. So Just now we have to check whether the its uh, access is granted or not. So for that we are going to download uh, an app called Root Checker. Now as you can see the super SU uh, app has already been installed. Now to check whether we have correctly routed the phone we are going to use the app called Root Checker. So now you can see here SU it's showing uh, it's uh, showing that SU has found in the card and so and the root access is access granted so it is successfully we have rooted this phone after the successful routing of this phone we are going to install uh, android version lollipop that is 5.0 uh, we are going to actually first we have to actually install the cm12 zip file which is actually cyanogen mod 12 uh, in from the computer and then we have to copy that zip file into the sd card of the mobile So here we are copying the zip file into the SD card. So guys after copying the CM12 zip file into the phone, now we are going to reboot to the recovery mode. For that we have to press the volume up button, home button and the power up button simultaneously. Before that we have to power off the device. So after switching off the device we have to reboot to recovery mode for that we are going to press the volume up button home button and the power button simultaneously so now so now to navigate we are going to be using the uh, volume up and down button and to select we are going to be using the power button so first we have to clear the data and the cache So first we wipe the data.
and now we are going to wipe the catch now we have to select the installed zip file from the SD card for CM12 So now we are going to be installing the CM12 uh, zip file. So we may have to wait for some time for it to reboot. Go. So guys now we are going to reboot the system to check whether this version has been installed in the phone or not. So for that we are going to go back. आने के बोल रहा हूँ। हाँ, अभी देखो। So now, as you can see, the Cyanogen Mod 12 has been successfully installed in the mobile. So as you can see we are now checking out all the specs of the Cyanogen Mod 12. For that we have to go to the settings and see the specs in the about phone. So as you can see Cyanogen Mod 12 has been successfully installed. And the Android version has been upgraded to Android Lollipop that is 5.0.2.